Not a lot of risk there since he doesn't have priority. Kanoa now taking his first wave of the final. First turn solid, the local boy whips it vertically with some power, springing down the line to a solid third turn. Huntington Beach is on their feet, watching the local favorite off the bottom and punches it out, salutes the crowd in the finish. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Remember earlier this morning, we caught up with Kano Igarashi and we're asking him how he was going to pace himself. And he was like, hey, this is all part of the plan. We've seen him grow from strength to strength. But now in the final, that first wave, that first opportunity to open up and really light up this lineup, he framed every single one of his maneuvers so well. Staying critical, Joe, and just watch this. He just has that drop-in approach, tags that lip right there. That bottom turn sets him up to get vertical again. Third turn off the top, so just having the timing to tick every section off. And then also this inside connection and this turn through the inside, just sliding it there. We've seen a lot of people fall vict victim to that tricky inside section, and Kanoa just does it with ease. His brother is frothing for him right now. <laughs> Little Keanu <laughs> can't even contain himself. This is what Tomas did on the next wave. Well, Tomas, he has that judo chop off the lip, dialed, and he has also been that guy that's always wanted to make this inside section count. Gets a couple lip line bashes there, but smaller wave, you can tell he didn't dig into it as much as what Kanoa did and oh, 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 oh that is a that is a nice number. Kanoa Igarashi <laughs> starts the final with a 9.63. <laughs> Unbelievable start. The best start of the contest and to do it in the final in front of your hometown crowd is massive. That victory he can almost taste now but he has a lot of time on the clock for Tomas to mix it up.